Hello. My name's Mary. I'd like to welcome you to the drawing room. I'm the parlour maid to Mr and Mrs Holt. You may have met the master already. He's a very nice man, kind and considerate, and very fair-minded, and he's generous to a fault. Now, let me tell you something about my work. Well, my day starts about an hour before the family gets up. It's freezing cold then, especially in the winter, so my first job is to light all the fires so it's nice and warm when they come downstairs. There's some lovely fireplaces in this house, although they're not such a pleasant sight at six in the morning when they're unlit, I can tell you. And the one in this room is my least favourite. Oh, there's nothing wrong with it, mind. It's just that white marble and black coal don't mix too well, so I have to be very particular about keeping it spick and span. Do you like the furniture? It's lovely, isn't it? Oh, they come up lovely with a good spit and polish. I don't spit, really. It's not ladylike. But I am forever dusting the furniture and ornaments, and there are more in here than any other room. All those porcelain jars and bottles and fancy vases. Not that I'm one to complain, mind. No, it's a pleasure being surrounded by such beautiful things. Not like the house I grew up in. Still, we were happy. Bit of a tight squeeze, but we were never cold at night. Oh no, sleeping with five brothers and sisters saw to that. According to Mrs Holt, the drawing room is the best room in the house. And it's more comfortable if it's well furnished. Of course, she would say that, wouldn't she? She's never had to clean it. Not that I would say that to her face, naturally. Oh no, I'm not one to complain. It's not in my nature. No, nope, I just get on with my job. Mr Holt, on the other hand, is very fond of his pictures. And he's got quite a collection, too. My favourite is the one of Jesus as a boy in the temple. <gasps> There's so much detail in it. It looks so real. One of the old men even has a cataract on his eye. Mr Holt shows that to his guests. And if they don't believe him, he makes them look at it through a magnifying glass. Honestly, he does. Oh, well, I better get going. Oh, it's been nice chatting, though. I don't get many visitors come and see me. Wait till I tell the others, eh? Ooh, goodbye.